Most people don't even realize Canva Pro can actually bring your still images to life. I often use this technique in my own projects and it makes my designs 10 times more engaging, but hardly anyone knows this trick exists or how to do it. In this video, I'll show you the exact process step by step. And stick around because by the end of this video, you'll know how to use this effect to make your own content jump to the next level. Let's get started. Okay, first thing, I opened Canva up, then I clicked on YouTube video or video and chose a landscape size page like this. I'm starting off by opening up a video page in Canva. The goal is to break this image into layers so they can move independently from each other. To keep things simple, I'm also making a copy of the image. Right now, it's one solid piece, but I'll show you how to split it up for an amazing animation effect. First, I'll go to Magic Studio and pick Magic Grab. Quick heads up, this is a tool for Canva Pro users, but trust me, it's worth it. I'll adjust the brush size and paint over the parts I want to keep. And once I'm done with that, I'll click grab. Look at that, Magic Grab separated the image perfectly. Now I'll expand the bottom of the background to create even more space for this animation. To do that, I'll be using Magic Expand, which is another incredible tool in Canva's Magic Studio. After selecting the foreground image, I'll let Canva generate four different options. Then I'll pick the one I like best. And just like that, I've extended that part of the image. Check this out. It's also added in all this white up here that I don't need. Time to use another magic tool. How about the background remover? That layer is chosen. Now click on it and let's see if it gets rid of all of that white area. It's not perfect, but for now, I'll pretend that those little bits of white are snow. So there you go. You've just watched me use several different tools used in this tutorial so far. I use the background remover, magic grab, and magic expand. With everything set up, now it's time to animate. I'll select the foreground layer with the biker, hit animate, and create a simple upward movement. For the background layer, I'll enlarge it a bit and make it move downward for an interesting contrast. If it's a bit wobbly, I'll just adjust the path to make it smoother. Now it's time to animate. I'll choose the foreground layer with the biker, hit animate, and create a simple upward movement. For the background layer, I'll enlarge it and make it move down for a cool contrast. If it's a bit wobbly, I'll adjust the path to make it smoother. Then click on the animate button again, select the B, and this time drag the background image downward. To add some extra interest, let's bring in some clouds from the elements tab. I'll animate them to move across the screen, making sure they're positioned behind the trees for a more realistic look. Same as before, click on Animate, select the B, and with the cloud highlighted, I'll pull it over like this. Let's add another cloud and do the same thing. Yeah, that'll work. All right, let's watch it. I need to change the layer, so I'll put the clouds in between. Yes, that's better. 
That's exactly what I wanted. Now you've seen a brand new way to take a static picture and then to turn it into something completely unique and animated just by using the tools here in Canva. By using Magic Grab, Magic Expand, and Background Remover, I've taken a static image and transformed it into an entirely new and unique animated scene. Best of all, these tools are included in Canva's paid plan, and they can really help you take your videos, presentations, or any creative project you're working on to the next level. You could add snow, rain, other creatures, nature sounds, etc. What do you think you could make using these techniques? Time to go to Canva and experiment. I hope this excites you enough to try something new on your own. Have fun! And if you love finding out about crazy cool AI tricks before everyone else, Subscribe now so you're the first to know when new AI tools drop. Until next time, keep creating, keep innovating, and keep making it with AI. Thanks for watching.